is, is honestly up to Salem if he does play Snake. Like, how well can you play to not get touched by Mario? Okay, man. Yeah, Snake's, Snake's here. Yeah. This would be a big win for Master Mario, though. I think he's now top five in SoCal. Around there? You can pull it up. We're going to find out. SoCalSmash.net yeah. has it. Yeah, he's uh, gone up. He's only gone up since the Ultimate's come out. Like, he had such a big, like, improvement from Smash 4. Like, towards the end of Smash 4, he was, like, slowly becoming a good player in SoCal. And then, like, as soon as Ultimate came out, he just, like, submitted himself as one of, like, the best players. He's number four. Okay, nice. Wow, top four, dude. Yeah. That's Mario. That Evo run, like, definitely put him on the map for sure. Well, uh, let's see what he can do here against Salem. Ooh, I like the up B. Oh, it's not something you see Mario's do too much. It's kind of up B out of scramble situations yeah. like that. It still, comes out it's, frame three. It's still really good. Get off me, so. Uh -oh. Big combo time. Yep. I like the back air. Kind of sets up for another back air, and then, you know, you take more stage position than you do with just continuing an up air strike. Nice. Yeah, Salem's always in position for that, like, grenade explosion to uh, aerial. Yeah. And the, the back air just stays out for so long, the sleeping bed. Yep. Haven't heard it called that in a while. <laughs> oh, that Nikita yeah. trap was so good. He, ha he actually had him, but uh, great timing on the air yep. for Master Mario with the up tilt. I knew it. Yeah. He uh, baited him to jump by putting the grenade in front of him, and then immediately anti air up tilt. That was like an a easy jump read for Salem. All right, so you can use the flood to push the grenades back. Yeah. That's what I think Mario has in this matchup. Oh, nice! Ooh. Using the grenade explosion to extend his throw. Almost got a combo off it too. Oh, I love the wave dash through the grenade. That was yeah. so clean. I think it, I think he poked the shield with that too. Nope, Damn. big's big, big heavy boy. Yeah, he there's a down there. Yeah. yeah, he actually tried to DI it too, but it's just strong. He had the right DI. He did, but <laughs> not not something you see off. Now, okay. So fire moves detonate the grenades, right? Yes. Why does the fireball not? That's weird. That's actually really weird. Yeah, right? It's fire property for sure. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> just now I'm just like, I'm like stuck trying to find a reason. But anyways, Salem off to a huge lead, 35% oh. on him. And he gets the up tilt, taking Master Mario's second Dude, stock. he's so good at like forcing Master Mario to go exactly where he wants. For the up tilt. Yeah, he, he can, can actually yeah, just run through it. He can run through it, yeah. He's that fast. Oh, that grenade was so smart. He like put it right next to him while he was falling, so like Master Mario couldn't even chase him. Oh, oh. he's dead. Yeah, now he had no jump from getting his landing caught by dash attack. Yeah. I actually don't think Mario can recover from directional air dodge off stage. He can recover from neutral air dodge, but not directional. Yeah, unless away from there's the a wall. Unless there's a wall. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. If, he, if it's a wall, he can like, just wall jump back. Yeah. But we don't have any, other than Kalos, we don't have a wall stage. It's like kind of PS2, but it's hard. It's really difficult to wall jump on that stage. It's also super unsafe. Kind of dominant for, for Salem, I would say. Yeah, definitely. I mean, he, he was conditioning him really well, and, you know, he, he was just taking advantage of the fact that he was able to force Master Mario to be in the position that he wanted to put him in. And he ha it doesn't even seem like he revealed that many mix-ups either. Yeah, he's just playing really safe. Yeah, Master Mario hasn't really been able to get that many huge combos either. But as I say that, I'll have an extension. Two back airs, but get the second one. Ooh, a grenade trade, not what you want. Yeah, all of this is just benefiting the snake for the most part because, you know, he needs to get his damage through a couple, like, a few neutral wins and then trades, right? And so Mario, he just needs that one neutral win, really, to, to get in and get his percent. So any time that you're spending trading is time that you're not, you know, getting your one hit. Oh, so smart at catching these landings from Master Mario. He's just been jumping in a lot of bad spots, but I like the wave dash or wave land on the platform. Oh, big trade for Salem. Where's he going to drift here? Oh. Oh, he had him. Oh. I can't believe he, he neutral air dodged the up smash, though. Like, that was perfect timing to get past that. Yeah. Oh, wow. he knew he would roll. Salem definitely knows what Mario wants in this matchup. Yeah, he's definitely all over past Mario. And he just can't seem to take the stock. Yeah, Salem playing like the ultimate keep away game right now. 
safe fear versus C4 too. And the way he's recovering, he's doing it in a way that Master Mario can't really just go get him. Nope. Oh! He was fine actually getting blown up there because he just gets more recovery mix up. Yeah. All right. Up air, okay. Up air finally killing almost 200%. Yeah. Yeah, Mouse Mario needs a big combo, but yeah, Sa Salem is just not giving it to him at all. Oh my god, that wave line up so? Excuse me? Oh, he's moving Dude, too he's well. he's all over He's now. moving a little bit too smooth with Snake right now. Oh, he crossed him up. Can he get a combo here? Jumps away, and gets the beer reverse. Oh, down dude, throw Epso? No. He just knows where he's going to be. Yeah. It's really good for Salem. Look at that trap, dude. He did the see, he did the Nikita up so it would fall down, making his Nair safe. Like, and he did it off screen, too. Yeah. In a way that Master Mario couldn't tell if he did it at roll range or if he did it at neutral get up. Dude, that was, that was so good. Wow. Yeah. Oh, OK. Yeah. That was weird. That was like a weak hit. He hit the Nikita, he it. and it was still active. I think it was the issue was that he nared. If he like up aired or something like that, and he would have been able to act in time, but the nair just you sit there for too long. Oh man, grenade up to this, this whole free twenty seven percent. Why not? Yeah. Yeah, just looking at this, Nasmaro is not really able to. Well, this is a big start, but Finally, he's not yeah. really able to get damage without trading with grenades. It's just been really hard for him. Like, getting in in general is just very difficult. And then when he does get in, he just keeps... Like, the trades are in Salem's favor every time. Right. And Salem, he's just getting everything he wants. Yep. He knew that he would go away from the grenade from the down throw. All right, how's he going to mix up here? Nice. Goes high, directional air dodge. Or, he's air dodge. Oh, he knew. He knew, dude. He, he normally he got a last spot dodge and then parry the hit? No, he he just, I think he just sat there. Oh, okay. Yeah. Still, that was really good. He didn't even need, like, the free down throw up to no, got, like, the tech chase. Yeah, I mean, he was a he was a decent percent before that was true. Yeah. But it ended up working out for him. And yeah, this is so good for Salem. Yeah. Salem's chilling right now. He, you know, he's not really having to bring most of the mix-ups out of the bag. Yeah, I just haven't seen him in any real pressure situation, if I'm being honest. Like, he's just been looking comfortable from start to finish. Uh, okay, interesting. I thought he would DI it towards where his C4 was. Yeah, I did too, but instead he kind of DI'd on the platform, which is not something you see people do against Mario. Right now. Yeah, and Master Mario wasn't even really able to get a big combo either. I wonder if he just was surprised by the way that Sam yeah. DI'd. But, damn, these pivot grabs. Salem is catching Master Mario's landing so consistently. Oh my goodness, almost dying to that up tilt. The parry master right now. Dude, how do you get in on this guy? The he's mind field. He's leaving a trail of breadcrumbs, dude. It's like canceling bro. <gasps> he's he just baited, there yeah, he baited that roll so hard. Oh, he's actually lucky that he got blown up by his own grenade because he was going to up air him. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's actually just going to raw up tilt, I'm telling you. Yeah, he's looking for it. Dash attack. Now he'll die to down throw up so, so he can't get grabbed. <laughs> Somehow that Nikita still hit. Bro, he dropped. Oh my. Weak Nikita. What the heck? Weak falling Nikita killed. And he's at 52%. Oh. All right, Salem, so you need to chill. You need to calm down, dude. <laughs> this is a show, dude. Salem's really just showing us, like, these different mix ups that Snake has and. All the interesting ways that you can just put your opponent in the dirt. Yeah, this is so hard for Master Mario right now. Honestly. Like, he looks, looks very lost. But, punch that unsafe up tilt. He's going to need a big combo here. But uh, knowing the way, or you know the way Salem's been playing, like, he knows exactly what Master Mario wants. But yeah, he tried to do, like, a delayed yeah. uh, double jab to up tilt to catch, like, the roll or something. Yep. That ledge trap is so hard to get past. Wow, he baited that out. He didn't get the up to it. Yeah, he's just a little slow. Oh. Wait? <laughs> if he Wait? kills him off that somehow, that would be amazing. But Master Mario, he's still... He's actually working his way back into this Yeah, game. yeah, yeah. He's not out of it yet. What wow. the heck? All right. I think he mixed up his DI. Oh, yeah, definitely. Most definitely. He died at 103. Snake's not supposed to die that early for that. 
That's All right. I mean, he's, he's got the lead, but he's in dire straits on this stock. So we'll see what oh Salem does and take it if he can. He does not care about that foot. Oh, that's why I was playing so scared right now. <laughs> he's not playing in the air anymore. Like, Salem's just looking for this anti-air up tilt, and he's just making sure. Oh, he's dead. He's just making sure that he's not short hop back airing unsafely, anything. And, you know, Salem finally able to put on enough percent that he can get that down throw up tilt. Oh, he fell out. Oh. Opportunity here. Oh, he went for a mix up, but Salem seeing through that. Kind of uh, not worth, honestly. I would just go for the guaranteed damage. Oh! Nah. Off oh, of the grenade? Oh, Off of the grenade. My. He died at 103 and 99 to up yeah. he, he coming off the grenade, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. All right. Well played, dude. I good. didn't think that still killed that early, especially on Snake. But hey, man, Pokemon Stadium. Damn. It's that low I ceiling. Mean, just keep playing on it till it works. Yeah. Mario's I mean, gonna win at least once. At least once. Damn. Interesting. We're going to Kalos. What? I, I, maybe he banned Town. I don't know. Yeah, this one's confusing for me. I guess you ban town because it's like the big blast zones, right? Kalos is big, but it's like, it's not big in the same way. I just think Snake is going to set up his yeah. tent for, for free on this stage. But I know Master Mario is actually really good on Kalos, too, so. I know he's that. A, he actually is fine with this stage. Like, he gets a lot of combos like this. Oh. Yeah, like, he's very good at getting the side platforms. He should be dead here. Like, he should be able to, like, just kill him off this. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Great tech from Taylor, honestly. The thing about Kalos compared to Town, though, is that Town, the platforms are inconsistent. They're constantly leaving, so Snake can't just throw the C4 on there and, you know, leave it there for most of the match. So with the consistent C4 on the side platform, Salem's actually going to be able to get some throw setups into the C4. Now Samaro getting a little thirsty for the kill here. Throwing out that PS above smash. Nice, switch to the platform. Movement so crisp for Salem right now. Oh, he, okay, thank God he could wall jump there because he did not land. Oh, Salem's kind of slick right now. Oh, yeah, he's so slippery. Oh, my God, the double grenade? Yo, he's, he's launching for this up tilt. You see him tracking yeah, him? Yeah, Masamaro's like, like playing really scared, but there's the back air. He needs to stock. He cannot let Salem get back to the stage. There yeah. it is. Okay. I would love to see Master Mario play a little bit more aggressive here. Like, really just push this lead, get this big combo. But he's, I don't know, I feel like he's respecting Salem a lot. But here we go. Opportunity. Oh. Oh, step up. Oh, no. I don't know if he wanted that fair. No. So well, I, like, I like putting the C4 here, because now if he gets a grab, then he can get a big combo off of it. Okay. Oh. Grenade playing interruption. Yeah, Masmaro jumps away from the grenade to continue his combo, actually. There is a spacing that you can hit him with the up air and not hit the grenade. Yeah. That's what, what separates people that are really good versus Snake and other people. Yeah. Like, you see Void play against Snake. This guy is, like, laser precise with his forward airs. Yeah. Oh. oh. Bad spot for Master Mario. Yeah. Uh, that's just fortunate trade for Master Mario because he was getting his landing trapped like super, super hard by Salem. We haven't really seen any capes. Yeah. Like. He's been caping the grenades occasionally, but yeah, that move's kind of lagging, so I don't blame him for not going. Oh, oh, smart, smart cape on the up yeah. smash. All right, this is a moment where none of them want to make a mistake because whoever does should die yeah. at this percent. Oh, that was so smart! Do you see him dashing behind his grenade and... Oh my... His grenade He's gonna die to a grenade. Crazy dude. good. He can't get grabbed here. Like, there's so much that he can't do. He yeah, can't be in the air. Can. Yeah. But playing around grenades, like, you want to jump a lot of times. Yeah. That's why I'm thinking, like, the cape is probably just a better option in that situation, but... Oh! oh he said, he was get just that holding, jab holding, out of my yeah, face! what was that? He thought he would be scared of it, honestly. But now Smarl outranged him with the fort smash. Uh oh, landing trap. He has no jump here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Backing up tons of percent. So much pressure on the platform. He caught it. Oh no. Yeah, he caught it and then blew it before he could throw it. Taking so much damage here. 
like the flood there, take that stage control. Yep. Salem doesn't even really, really need it. Ooh. I mean, he's taking it, but he doesn't need it. I'm just trying to find a way in. But these grenades are just everywhere that Salem wants them to be. Oh my gosh, dude, the item play right now. Yeah, this is Salem. so good. Great mash. He's dead? No, he's chilling unless he reads him. I thought he would up to uh, out of the grab release. Okay, man. Master Mario on his last legs in the set. Oh, that was safe completely. Yeah, the grenade would mess that up. Oh, this one played so patient. He was like, please air dodge. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my. Wow. Great Inches away from that. the yeah. C4. Oh, my God. That range. He was 10 feet away, bro. That I'm range. <laughs> that was great. Oh, I'm so good. Yeah. I think he was going up for a grab or something like he that. He might have extended his hard yeah. box, yeah.